not happy at all with her fourth place finish in the recent Olympic Games. She enters this free program in second place behind Yuka Sato. She's a very unusual skater in every way. Look at that. One skate is one kind, another skate is another kind. The landing supposedly needs a different skate than the takeoff. I've never thought that myself. Everything about this girl is unusual. 20 years old from Nice in the south of France. Speaking of being original, right after the spin, don't blink or you'll miss a double axle. That's very incredible, actually. This shows your jumping strength. Three jumps in a row. up on her quality of skating. It's just not there. Surya Bonoli with only one skater left, Yuka Sato. Skating for a possible gold medal. She won the silver in Prague a year ago, her best ever performance in international competition. This is the toughest part of her program, believe it or not, another triple-triple combination. Triple flip, triple toe loop plan. Bouncing around in the landing of that second one, that's going to be only a quality deduction. She's really throwing in the triples tonight. to Vivaldi's four seasons, hoping that this is her winning season. Will it be gold? Loads and loads of technical difficulty. 
The question is, how will they see her artistic effort? Well, she brought a whole truckload of triples with her tonight, but not a lot of flow out of the jumps. Like the landings didn't power through. She struggled through one of the landings, putting her hand down, but this is one place she didn't struggle. The control of this triple toe, half loop, triple sackout, and then with her strength, she pulls off another double toe. That's pretty incredible stuff. Now technical merit. And some five nines that please her. Those are as high as any we've seen. But historically, this next set, her downfall. That's for sure. 5-5 five, five from Canada, 5-5 five, five from Germany. So Bona Lee is in first place, but the judges have left considerable room for the final skater. Thank you, Sean.